guys and welcome back to Tweetopia, my city in city skylines, where last time we were doing a whole load of work on this coastline here. Uh, we seem to have got an awful lot of people packed in and we can tell that we've got a lot of people packed in because, well, if we have a look down at our RCI indicator here, we need everything apart from residential. So we're not going to be doing any more residential constructs today. I think we're going to be trying to fit in um, a load of offices i think maybe this side could be some nice office space i mean this 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 whole splurgy bit of nastiness here not the greatest thing in the world let's have a look and see which way can we can we see which way the water flows to show us which way the water flows it doesn't unfortunately oh no we've got a few few arrows over here so yeah the water not really flowing away from here i've got a feeling this hydro plant that we've put up is possibly the reason the water's not flowing away, but at the same time, I mean, look at this. This is, this is beautiful. I love this. Um, all right, so with all that in place, let's get to building maybe here. I know I was going to save this for residential, but I'm kind of feeling this could be a good place to put some offices. What do these guys have? Not enough educated workers. That's all right. We can sort that out. Educated workers are something that can be dealt with. Uh, I think actually talking about the the offices this possibly is a good spot for them yeah yeah i don't think we've got anything here and then we can redesign this little little bit here and then we'll yeah we'll move all the all the residential from here downwards a bit so let's get the office segment on the go let's get rid of all these what is that what is some of these uh let's just keep clicking and making sure we can turn it all into office right this you what are you you're a police station that's all right you can stay there well done you are a useful product of society uh, definitely something we need to use okay so we pumped in a few of those um there's a firehouse here a small playground pumped in some offices and now we just gotta wait for them to grow whilst we're waiting for that to grow i think we need to have a good serious look at this here <coughs> excuse me uh, I'm definitely feeling that we could take out these roads and much better do some much better zoning around here. Uh, we are losing people at the moment. Uh, that's going to happen, you know. We're going around destroying stuff. I probably pause this so we're not quite losing all the. Oh, oh, this is facing the wrong direction now. What is this? We've got a medical clinic. I'm just going to relocate that literally there. Might not be what we wanted to have done, but that's what we're going to do. Okay, no money spent on destroying these houses. That's good. So we're just going to go through and destroy all of these houses so that we have a nice blank canvas to work from, like including all this lot here. Uh, I'm now trying to decide whether um, I want to take the housing estate off of this road or off of this road. Now, one of the problems I've got, let's come out here, is this connection right here. You can see that we're really starting to take a bit of a battering on this, this highway here, mainly because all they'll do is use this middle lane to go either this way or this way. So I think we need to do something about that. So maybe we don't want to pack this road out anymore. That said, where else could they be coming from? Well, they would be coming from this way. So I think maybe actually, yeah, if they come in from this side of the city, they'll go around that way. Unfortunately, if they come in from this side of the city, they're going to want to come up here. Uh, and then they're probably going to want to use this bit of road because it'll be a slightly shorter distance. I don't know. Let's have a look. Those two lane roads... Uh, I was told the other day, yeah, that shows you the speed on there. It's a 50. I can't point it out with my map. Uh, whereas the highway is 100. So hopefully, you know, it's not double the distance going out and around there. So hopefully they'll go straight on. Yeah, that was a lot of work. A lot of thinking just to make this happen here. Okay, let's destroy all this. That end one is a medical clinic. We're probably going to have to end up, like, moving everything around here. Uh, I know we're going to have to go in and redo the bus routes at some point. So, where are we looking at a serious... Maybe this one, actually. If we pull this back and come to our two-lane road here, can we, from, I don't know, here, come down and straight... I don't know, let's try it here. Space already occupied. That That's terrible. What? Don't, don't try and tell me that. How can we come out and be useful? Not there. Okay, let's try it like this. We're going to come out here, and then we're going to turn almost immediately. Yeah, yeah, okay, this this is good. And then we've got a little bit of an avenue going all the way down there, and then maybe down to here. Oh, doesn't like that. There we go. All right, that, that looks good to me. This looks like a nice 
wonky road that we can start building a bit of a, a bit of a system off of. Uh, let's have a look in here. Do we want to run a road from there down to here? I think we might. I think we might. Um, we'll, it all depends on how busy this bit gets. If this suddenly becomes an absolute thoroughfare where everyone is uh, decided that they actually want to go and live up that way, then we will try and do something about that. Right, let's... Where do we want this then? If it's not going to work there... No, that's a little bit off as well. Let's try the snap to grid option. I, was, I turned it off because we were in this corner and that was a bit of an awkward place. But if we kind of do that... No, one more out. Something like that? Yeah. And then we can come down. It's not going to let me go all the way. So if we do that and then do this. Yeah. Yeah, looks good enough. Uh, so once again, I'm going to come out one more to about here. Okay. So hopefully we're going to end up with a nice little... Uh, housing estate here where people are going to be happy to live you know we've we've got some got some leisure over here we've got to figure out how we're going to fill this space in but no, that's not going to be too much of an issue uh i think in fact that can just go like that and then everybody's happy right yeah everybody looks happy here uh a few more roads just to make sure maybe not there maybe up here yeah yeah let's turn that snap to grid off and see if we can't get it running up here like this Something like that. Looks good to me. Looks good to me. So let's uh, zone up some normal density buildings. I suppose low density. We only really have high and low density. We don't We don't have like a medium or anything like that. Would be nice to have a third third setting. Like on SimCity. SimCity used to have all these settings. Though saying that, I've not played SimCity since SimCity 4. Um, the, the, the most recent SimCity just looked massively disappointing. And all I heard was massive... Uh, uh, complaints about it, so yeah, don't don't really want that to happen like that. Okay, so what's going on here? Is this something we can actually take advantage of? I'm not overly sure because we've got this like dead space here. I'd like to maybe put in another park. I mean, I know we've got another park there, but if we could get no, it's a little bit a little bit thin. Some something like that. If it was a little bit longer, it would be ideal. That that's no good. Too big too small. Oh, well, I suppose we're going to have to use this one then, and then... Oh, no. 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 Yes, I would like to do that. I want it kind of sitting up and against this pathway here. Yeah, and then we'll just put a, a, a few trees in this place, and then it almost look like an actual park area. And people could be happy with stuff, right? That's, that's what I'm hoping for, anyway. Uh, just a few trees in place. Let's put these in the middle. Boom. Oh, beautiful. Okay, let's play it up and see what will happen. Now, the most in intriguing thing is going to be what's happened to this bus route. Uh, let's have a look at the line. No, that's no good. We can't tell it from there. Okay, we're going to come in here via this. You know what? That kind of works. That kind of works. If we could get this one coming that way to begin with. No, no, no. That does some weird stuff. Uh... Ah, this is the problem here. Okay. Well, we seem to have a stop either side of this road. So if I pull this up here... Very strange things happen. Very strange things. So I was expecting that to have a stop up here. Uh, let's put a stop somewhere up here. And then we're going to start putting in extra lines for this. So we grab this and we pop it over here. And then we grab this and pull it up here. Going to do a similar thing on this side of the road in fact I think if we just pull in some stops here we can then put little pathways over and then that should make everybody happy hopefully maybe maybe who knows uh, this I don't think we actually want to be zoned here maybe we'll put in some offices if we have anything here but we, we don't want this little stretch of road getting overrun in fact no we're not going to put offices in yet we're not going to put offices in yet. So straight away, you can see the industry has gone down. And we are left hankering after commercial properties. Got to do something about this. We, I mean, look at this. Look how much it's backing up. Just because we're at a bit of a standstill here. I don't, I don't even see where people are going, really. They kind of get here. And then everything breaks up. I've got a feeling the problem might actually be this, this bit here. I know we're not travelling around 100, 100 whatevers per second here. Okay, let's let's try and think of ways of fixing this. Um, can we just do a bypass? Is is that a thing that can happen? If we take a, a one-way road here, pull it out and 
go up somewhere. Something like this. And if we can go straight across, I will be a happy, happy man. We can go up there. Uh, we've got the straight road, so let's continue going over. Uh, let's spin this round so we can see where we're going. Will this go here? It will. Oh, okay. And then maybe somewhere a little bit further on, we can put it down somewhere. Uh, I am wondering whether it actually wants to go into this road or down further this way. Let's just try going further this way and see if that does anything to uh, relieve the pressure that is on the go at the moment. Something like that. Uh, that's quite a road, it has to be said, but let's see if anybody's going to end up using that road. This could mean that we've got it completely in the wrong place. Uh, it could mean that instead of people wanting to use this road, what we actually wanted to do was bring it off of this side and go that way. I don't know. It, there doesn't appear to be any alleviation of traffic at this present moment in time, though people do appear to be... I don't know, not backing up quite as far. We're, we're not quite all the way back here yet. I don't know, we're going to wait. We're going to see if anybody uses this road. It's a horribly janky road. Let's go and have a look and see what was going on over here. Of course, we are bombed out with um, residential, so no one's really doing anything there. Uh, must need this commercial then. Must need the commercial. Where do we ha already have commercial zones and where can we build upon a new one? I think maybe somewhere over here might be a good place for more commercial. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, so, some sort of road somewhere. Uh, perhaps coming off this and we can turn this into a four-way intersection. I don't know if four-way intersections are super bad or not. I'm sure they are somehow. Uh, so we're going to go up this far. Let's turn the grid back on, shall we? No, not allowed to just turn the grid back on. Uh, and we are going to kind of follow this highway here. If we go like that and then like this. And we're not going to join up completely, though we are going to throw some pathways across. Uh, and that should hopefully make it so people aren't trying to use the road all the time. Something like that. And maybe maybe on this side as well. That that would be cool, right? And then we'll take it over there. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, okay. A uh, little bit more roadage, because the roadage is the important bit. Uh, do we want to go up and down this way? Maybe. Maybe. Let's... Let's try it. Let's see how far out we want to go first. And there. Yeah, I like that. We're going to turn the snap to grid off, though, just so we can run it up along this sideline here. Perfect. What about this one? Is this perfect? It's not. If we could come out to about... Ooh, not quite there. Just a little bit further. Just so you see the, the blue uh, rectangle that shows where the... Ah, I see it didn't didn't go quite as far so what I did is I came out um, far enough just to touch this side but somehow it's got rid of this corner here I was hoping that it would make uh, a lot of zoning space obviously uh, let's do that and see if that's a useful space this little triangle in the middle it's just a place for some scrub land right uh, let, let's put some of these down I can't can't see what's going on uh, a few of these let's just get a little bit of bush life living back here um, nothing overly impressive. Right, now, what we wanted here was commercial. Big style commercial. We're going to have to put a metro line in here, I think. Uh, definitely going to need some sort of backup on the travel system. Because, uh, obviously, people need to get here. People need to do work. People need to be able to do things. A little bit worried about where a train line could go, actually, thinking about it. I mean, wouldn't it be great if we had a cargo line just here so we can move the cargo in and out? Let's uh, plonk that down. Can we follow... <laughs> it's going to be a lot of noise there. Can we follow this road up, out, and make some sort of connection? I don't know. Let's find out. Big rubbish problems over here. I think maybe we could fit an incinerator around. Let's try it. Let's try it. Uh, just do that wise. we are thinking about it. Boom. See, that was easy. <laughs> easy things dealt with. That's a firehouse as well. Just, just want to keep up on what's going on. Right. Trains! Let's try and cross this place over here. If we could do it with a double step, maybe? We can. Look at that. We'll just go over the top there. Uh, obviously, always worried about these power lines. Uh, does that not just go over the top? Is that not something that can happen? 
And a bit of a shame. A bit of a shame. We're going to keep this rail raised here. Uh, and also now, before all the power completely dies. Nah, that's not something we can do. Can we go underneath? We can't go down. That's a shame. I would like to have... Uh, I'd like to have put some underground wires in place. Uh, no, th this one, please. Let me just delete that, and then we're going to try and... Oh, we are a grand city. We can use solar power, finally. Ah, oh, been, been waiting for it. We can take on a third line. Is that all we get for being this? That's strange. Uh, so we've got a whole load of landmarks access to. Uh, the achievements are actually still something we've got to be working on. Use the asset editor, no. Uh, have more than 10 districts with unique policies? Maybe we could do something like that. No water or ground pollution in a city of over 10,000. You what? That's not going to be a thing that happens. Have fire, five fire stations. I think we can do that. These, these are all things I think we can do. Uh, we will get to them in a moment, though. Uh, I'm going to pull this up here. Something like that. And then they should just connect together. No? They're not going to just connect together? Come on, let me have it. Uh, okay. Once again, it's a it's a clicking issue. Where do we where do we click to? There we go. Yeah, it doesn't look dodgy at all. <laughs> all right, let's just carry on putting in some, some train line here. Uh, over this way, this train line. I think we're going to want the freeform tool. It's uh, a little bit, a little bit happier to use this. You know, we come down here. This is straight line, so we come round, and then we can bend round this way. Once again, we've got some power lines to worry about. I might put down onto the surface here. Yeah, there we go. Just so we can deal with that. Just so we can deal with that. Right, let's carry on moving. Uh, I'm sure there's going to be a little turn off here somewhere. Oh, there we go. That's that's a nice connection going on there. Now, I'd like to join these two up, if that's a possibility. Um, yeah, and then everything should be all right from there, I'm hoping. You can just... Uh, not freeform talk. Straight line. Go on somewhere along here. You'll do it. No. Okay, let's try it. Coming out here and down like this until we can come on straight there. And then some... No, no. Do you not like that? That's a shame. I don't want to curve out quite like that. Okay, let's try deleting this bit and this bit. Let's go from this side. Where would it let me take it off this side? There we go. Something like that. And then we can come up here. Boom. Brilliant. That's not an awkward train junction at all. You know what it needs, though? It needs some trees. Everything needs trees. Just makes things look a little bit better. In my opinion. If you guys think that it doesn't, then, you know, let me know. There are many ways of letting me know things. Mainly in the comment section of the video you're watching. Uh, a lot of people get hold of me in different places about different things. And I'm like, uh, that would be great, dude. I'm just not quite sure what you're referencing. So, yeah. Keep a note of what you're referencing. Uh, there we go. All right, brilliant. That kind of looks all right. This, this, this doesn't. What's this? What's this? Put some small trees in. Brilliant. A building has burnt down. I'm not really worried about buildings burning down. One thing I'm worried about is how things get from here to over there. Uh, it's a little bit of a problem. A little bit of a problem. Just like our water issue is a little bit of a problem. Okay, I'm seeing problems. Problems everywhere. Things like that. We've got some um, some furnaces that aren't really burning. Uh, we've got some garbage that needs taken care of. Where are we going to put a nice little garbage centre? See, it'd be nice to have a little run off here somewhere. Some, something that was just for this place. I don't think we can put it anywhere that it will be that though. Oh, look. Oh, look. Do the furnaces make ground, make water pollution? Is this a thing? Because like, I could quite easily just pop this down here and then everyone's like happy, right? No water. No water. Other than that, everyone's happy, right? Yeah, like that. There we go. That, that should make things a little bit better down this end. Hopefully this furnace will be taking care of everyone down this road. Because what else is he going to take care of? Alright, so we've got a few more things that we need to, to take care of. Like we could do with some more buildings down this way I suppose. Uh, no, no, actually that's kind of alright. Alright, we could do with a little bit of an offshoot here. Or we could do with moving this train line further through. I'm not sure if we want the tra Oh wow. Oh, wow, oh, wow. What has happened here? What has happened here? We're going to have to make uh, some rather interesting junction here, I think. We're going to have to sit down and think long and hard. I think maybe I'm going to have to go and play around in the asset editor and think about how we can get a 
uh, two lane junction meeting up with a highway without this stopping business I mean, look at this what is this maybe we want to make a, uh, a roundabout here with the uh, highway traveling underneath and then we can have some nice off ramps everywhere and then everyone should be a little bit smoother hopefully I mean we could lose lose this corner of town here to for a junction and this one here I suppose but anyway, with that, I'm going to have to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. Uh, let's let's just cruise on over here and we'll have a look at our, some of our new areas. Uh, this time, today, we built a residential zone that isn't really taking off incredibly well, though the suburbs do seem to be building up. And if we come down here, of course, we have given these guys jobs and stuff because, you know, everyone wants job security. Uh, we've got some commercial over here and we built up this little office zone here that I'm hoping will... Oh, look, it's, it's very close to being, like, fully educate more citizens to allow building to upgrade. Make sure your educational facilities can handle. So we're going to be doing education next time. But anyway, I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!